What if I told you that just three drills could drop three or more shots from your score? Yes, we're talking about putting and here's how. Hello beautiful golfers, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna to talk about putting, the most important aspect of our game. How do we save strokes on the putting green to improve our scores? So what separates golf from other sports is definitely alignment. Tennis court, we have alignment. Basketball court, we have alignment. Football pitch, we have alignment. But in golf, we have to make our own idea of straight. So when we find this straight putt, we're gonna set two alignment rods around the ball. And now visually, I am seeing this path to the hole. This is what we wanna do. We really wanna see paths to the hole so we can start our ball online. And I like three in a row. Three in a row tells me this is not a fluke. I am grooving something here. I am starting the ball online. And if I can do that consistently, I can take this to the golf course, which is what we wanna do, right? So three in a row, give yourself a little four or five footer, three footer if you're beginning. And these alignment rods are really helping me see straight. All right, so there's my three in a row, building in a little bit of confidence. So when I get out there and I get a nice straight putt, I can start the ball online. Second way we're gonna groove in our putting is longer putts. I'm gonna give myself a 30 footer and then I'm gonna set this limit line at least 10% pass. So for a 30 foot putt, that's gonna be three feet. So the saying speed is more important than line is definitely true. We're looking at a 30 footer here. I've got a line three feet pass. Anything more than 33 feet is unacceptable for me because then we're creeping into three putt territory. No one wants that. So I'm gonna give these three putts a go see if I can get them all between the hole and the alignment rod or in the hole. Okay, didn't hit the alignment rod, so I got myself a point there. Zero points for short, one point for just pass, two points for in the hole. This is a game you could definitely play with a buddy to get your speed groove. All right, look at that. And I'll give it one more. You guys could play to 11, working on speed. That's short, that's not gonna be enough. So that would be zero points in the game. I'm really working on speed because who wants this putt right here? A two and a half foot downhiller. Yes, it's makeable, but we definitely don't wanna be giving ourselves putts that give us a little bit of anxiety. So this drill, alignment rod drill, will definitely help with your speed. So my favorite drill for juniors is one foot, two foot, three foot. I like it because it adds in a little bit of pressure. First one seems easy, second one seems okay. And then the third one, you're really thinking about it, which is what you want. So I got a little right to left or here, but at one foot, it doesn't really matter, does it? At two feet, now it's gonna break a little bit more left. And now at three feet, I'm really thinking about the break. Can I keep the pace up? So I get it in the hole. So if you can set yourself under this type of pressure, one foot, two foot, three foot, you can count on yourself down the stretch to make putts to improve that score. If you're a little more advanced and you wanna shoot in the 70s and 60s, we could go two, three, four, and you give yourself varying breaks and slopes that way you can stress test yourself under what you would consider the toughest of conditions, making short putts under pressure. So those are your three drills. Hope you found them as helpful as I did. And as always, stay close to the channel for golf-related content. Until then, have an amazing week.